What's up, Jigsaw Pieces? And today, people, we are bringing you episode number 20 of our Pokemon Super Mystery Dungeon Let's Play. We're 20 episodes deep. It feels like only yesterday I started playing this. It's insane. But uh, if you guys, before we get started, if you wouldn't mind just tapping that like button down below, because your support really does mean the world. Now, in the last episode, you guys, we didn't have any jobs as such, but we did go ahead and do a bit of exploring to help fill the nexus, i.e. the map. And we met a couple of wandering tra travellers that ended up connecting with us, which was really awesome. But today, we are going across the pond with Archon. So let's see what the game's got in store for us. Let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. I had some soup in between recording the last episode and today's episode. So my belly is no more rumbling. No more rumble. <laughs> Give it to your all out there, team. Yeah! Alright, so we make it for the harbor. Yup. We're riding that Lapras travel liner. What's this? It seems the Pokemon Nexus on the second floor has been updated. Go access the Pokemon Nexus. Alright then. All right then. Fear the connection all into the Pokemon Nexus. Uh, uh, uh. Rank up! Ooh, we ranked up. Hello? Your Expedition Society rank has reached normal. We got a gold looplet. Ooh, what does that do? Progress device. A Lucha token. Mmm, number of preset teams increased to six. And that's not all! Songs added to the jukebox. Unlimited Dungeon 1, 2, and 3. V Wheel! And Battling Legends. Your 560 points from the next rank. Work hard to get Expedition Society points. Remove the connection all from the Pokemon. Ex Nexus, Nexus, Nexus. Oh my god, hello? We got new connections from this shit. Pokemon that are interested in the Jigsaw piece rush to you. The Jigsaw piece and Fear have been connected. And the other ones, like, you just ignored them. Why would you ignore them? Right, my OCD can't have that six sitting up there. Huh? No way. So, we found out that we can search on the new list now, so. Eh, 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 eh. There we go. Good. Woo! The map, you can't do nothing about until you've explored them, so that will just have to eat away at me. Just have to eat away at me. Alright, let's go to this lateral sliner. <laughs> Did you say Bulbasaur? He's right running sideways. Okay. Hello, Archin. Taking the kids out for a little fun today. It's a lovely day for it. What fun. Ah, um, my robbery was just for fun, but I'm afraid it's just another day of work. But this is kind of, kind of work is fun too. I am what? I, for one, am totally pumped up. What's this? You even have kids working for you now? Yeah, we're a part of the Expedition Society. Really? I thought children weren't allowed to join the Expedition Society. Don't ask me why, but the bus proved it this time. I guess there's no arguing it then. Well, it's if it's off for work, then I guess I'll just have to make an exception. Even if you are still children, I suppose two society members like yourself can ride without an adult. Really? Thanks, Lapras. But I'll go along with you this first time, just in case. First, we'll have to get you some passes, and then... Passes? You need a pass to cross the ocean to another continent, of course. Once you've bought yourself a pass, you can use it as many times as you like. You can buy a Lapras line of passes from the Keklian shop here in town. But we need money, right? If money is going to be an issue, why not just have your guardian here pay for you? Uh, 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 uh. Ah, me? Uh, I guess I have to say yes here. <laughs> And that's all there is to it. I don't care where we go. Just give us your cheapest passes you got. Always glad to serve. <laughs> Thanks a million, Archon. Thank you for shopping with us. We will look forward to seeing you again. <laughs> I see you went and bought yourself some Lapras liner passes. Then climb aboard. All right, we're going across the ocean. <laughs> Is there an animation for it? 
<gasps> As liars, liars. Huh? Huh? I can't keep going. Don't give up now, Ladius. If we stop now, they'll get us. You have to keep flying. We have to reach Time Travel Lake. Oh. My God! What is going down? I was thinking this. I was thinking, well, it's been like a long time since we've got to the thick of like the main story. A very long time. Wake up, sleepyheads. We're just about to land. Huh? What? Uh, when did we fall asleep? I feel like I've been sleeping for hours. Where did we end up anyway? Ooh, look at this place. This stand that looks a bit imposing. Hello? Oh, I guess my brain's still sleeping because I've got no idea where we are. I'm completely lost. Why don't we fire up the Expedition Gadgets map and have a look? What in the... The, the Air Continent? Wait, what? We, we came all the way to the Air Continent? Lively Town is way over here, so... Oh my goodness. <laughs> look at this little animation. It's pretty far, huh? All you had to do was take us to some little island near the town. How could you dummy here, Lapras? Me? You're the one who gave these kids passes to the air continent. Ah, I did. I never even looked at the passes that I bought. Sorry, kids. And this is your first trip overseas and everything. Look at me ruining your first big trip because I wasn't paying attention. We're totally fine with this. We came all this way, so let's at least have a look around. Um, just for a little bit then. Well, this is Barham Town anyway. Looks the same as every other town. It's got a calf and shops and all, just like back in Lively Town. You can go exploring dungeons from here too. All the dungeons on the air continent can be reached from right here, in fact. But we're not going to any of them today. You got that? We have a quick look around the town and then we'll get you two back home safe. But I want to go on exploration. Hello, Swanna. I may not look it, but I'm not. I'm good at cooking. I used to run a place called Swanna House. <gasps> that was in, uh, Gates to Infinity. It was. It was. It was. This is Barham Town. Welcome. Uh, uh. There's hidden items. Ooh. Give me more. Give me more. Is there any more? There's no more. Check out in here. Let's check it out now. Once. Oh, there's Nabra. He's asleep. My mind is empty. Be calm and relax. Whatever the situation, Aura will show you way. Welcome to the Cap Connection. Looks like there's no rewards here for today. Sorry, do come again. With the wind pushing back against me, I sometimes even manage to walk straight. It's kind of a curious feeling, kind of refreshing. Because <laughs> I brought walking zigzag. I used to run a gift shop. I tell you more if I take a lot of damage. What? Foes in dungeons don't scare me. Come on. I'm A, the ace of my kind. <laughs> I like that. I like that. So we're just, we, are we just literally talking to everyone? Oh, I knew a couple of new faces. You cute though. Although not as cute as me, of course. Alright, blow your own trouble. Oh, that's a Venusaur! Holy shit! Onward. Ooh, Nelly. There's a good wind blowing today, but it seems a bit different from the usual wind somehow. I don't know. It's all going over my head. <laughs> just talking shit in ya. I can't believe it. I know, right? It's pretty scary. What are they on about? I don't really care about talking to the shops. I just said I didn't care about talking to the shops. <gasps> it sure is nice to have friends, isn't it? I have one too, a best friend. Ah, that's nice. <gasps> Wikash. My name's Wikash. I once ruled a pond. <laughs> Do you want to hear about it? Yes. Because that was the evolution pond thing. Uh. Another Venusaur? Flowers are blooming all over. I sure don't come when I'm surprised. Please don't stall me. 
<laughs> oh, that's naughty. Don't think like that. My spores often go flying in the wind thanks to our stiff breezes. Living in sand like this is great for Pokemon like me. Our spores can really fire off. Breloom knows what I'm talking about. Here on the air continent, we live every day with the breeze blowing over us. So I spoke to everyone now, so... There's a trumpet! Don't you think we've seen enough for, and to call it a day already? We should be heading back home. What, already? But we've barely seen anything. I'll get start. I'll start getting late if we don't turn back soon. We should get set out now. Are you serious? That sounds terrifying. I do. I don't even want to think about it. Pokemon being turned into stone like that. Pokemon are being turned into stone? Uh, excuse me. Sorry, but could, ex could you explain what you're all talking about here? Uh, about Pokemon being turned into stone. It just keeps on happening around here. Pokemon show up. Rock solid stone. They've been turned into stone? Like it's not that they've become stone, but they've been turned into stone. Because that would mean that someone is turning them into stone, right? That's what it seems like. Not that anyone has any idea who would do such a thing or how. Rumor has it that they've worked on the flaming phantom. The flaming phantom? I really doubt... I doubt it's really a phantom or anything. Probably just a Pokemon like us, but some say that they've seen him near the Pokemon that were turned to stone. They say his body is reft in flames. So rumor has it that he may be burning Pokemon until there's no f nothing left but ash. And that's got everyone all spooked. They call him the Flaming Phantom. There are Pokemon rumors about, other po about Pokemon being turned into stone. All kinds of Pokemon have been falling prey up until now, but they say recently it's legendary and mythical Pokemon that are being targeted. So I've heard anyway. Somebody was saying they saw the flaming po fan ah! flaming phantom near the mystical forest. Time Travel Lake is in the middle of that forest. And the mythical Pokemon, Celebi. That's why everyone's all in the lava about the rumors again. I'm wondering if it might have come for, for Celebi next. But the mythical Pokemon is frightening. Nobody wants to investigate if it's true. Wow, what was that? Ooh, my god. <gasps> That's Laius landing us! Ooh, Something cracked down there. It's a huge cloud of dust, and it's coming from the mythical forest. The mythical forest? Everybody, please calm yourselves. My name is Archer, and I'm a member of the Expedition Society. The Expedition Society in the water continent? We Expedition members will go and investigate what is happening here. We ask you to stay, all stay calm and remain here. We will. We will. We will. You better not thinking about thinking. Of, you better not think of counting us out. Of course we're going. No, you're not. It's too dangerous for a pair of green kids. Didn't you hear what they said about that flaming phantom and the mystical forest? I can't let the pair of you face that kind of danger. Not on your first day. And besides, you'd probably just end up getting in my way. Yeah, but think of all the things you won't be able to do if you're alone out there. You can't do this on your own. We won't hold you back. We have. You have to let us help, please. Ah, I really don't have much choice. Fine action in the society. We'll leave this up to you for now. You will want, you'll want to make for that mystical forest from that road there. We'll appreciate your help. Just doing our job. Come on, kids. We're going to the mythical forest. Once we're in the dungeon, Jigsaw will take point for the group. I'll watch out for the rear. Let's do it. If there's anything to be found in the mythical forest, we'll find it. Ooh, my god. Oh, my god. Oh, my god. Mythical forest. First floor. Oh, there's a hop hip. Hop hip. Ha! Huh. Get bodied. Get bodied. I kind of don't want to use my flame burst because I feel like you're on low health. Alright, now I'm flame bursting. Boom! There's the star. Oh my god. Why? I don't want it. Oh, that's a Tangrowth! Oh, holy shit. That's kind of crazy. It's kind of crazy. Oh, fuck off with these traps! Two in the first two floors. Like, fuck off. Why you gotta be so rude? Got that flinch. Not that it mattered. 
There's a the staircase. Third floor. I thought Archer was taking it up the rear. Why is uh taking it up the rear? <laughs> Why is Bulbasaur at the back? Oh fucking hell. My dirty mind sometimes. You stupidness. You missed your twit. Stop missing! Thank you. Oh, that was funny. That was funny. Stupid, but funny. Okay. Oh. I mean... Good job there, with that splash. Oh, really? Took us by surprise. Clutch performer. I remember it makes it easier to dodge attacks in a pinch. Let me pop that on me. Let me pop that on me. Full floor. Shit is getting real in this game. I was wondering when the main story was going to kick in. I wondered, I wondered. Oh, I wonder, I wonder, I wonder. Yes, I do. Honestly, I didn't expect it to be while we was learning about like how we can travel across places and whatnot. Fuck off with your leech seed. Uh, what is it? Barrage. Yes. Barrage. Let's pop that on. Babasha. Oh, wait. That barrage was the where you hit more than one. Oh, man. I should have put that on me. Amnesia. Catch this flame burst. Oh, he ate that up. He ate that up. Oh my god. Okay then. Oh, more more dust. Oh, we created one. What one did we create? God burst. Mm. You can have it, Archon. We also picked up the slumber wand. Is that an aromatase? Ugh. Ugh. Fucking ugly piece of shit. Sixth floor. Sixth floor. That's a grimer. I never understood why does grimer get hardened? Oh, stench. In a tetrified status, the Pokemon can't use move items or stairs. It can also can't do many other things, such as switch the leader or look around. The stairs will go away after a while. Yo, you got bodied. I can't. I can't do anything. I can't do anything. Flame burst. I ain't touching you again. I ain't getting petrified. Stop. Why? And now that burst. <sighs> Can you unblock my move? I really need it now. I really need flame burst. Oh my god. Can we please get flame burst? Poison guard. Uh, I guess. Yeah, I guess I can have that. Stop my shelf from getting poisoned. <gasps> There's stairs. Seven floor. Floor, floor. Uh, okay. Tactical. Oh, fucking I remember to say. Suck a dick. Oh, I hate them. I hate them so much. I hate their design. I hate their type. I don't. I just, huh. No. F fuck off. Can't use Dragon Rage. I have to flame burst. Sludge, yeah, sludge it. Fuck, why? Oh my god, just kill the damn thing. Thank you. Fuck that thing. Wand expert. I know. Ugh! Just got it. Super critical. <clears throat> yeah. You alright up there? Yeah, he's fine. He's fine. He got it. Ah, oh, stop amnesia! You eat up hits. Too long. 
No, I don't want to fall asleep. I don't want to fall asleep. I don't want to fall asleep. Ouch. If I thought oh, I should have swapped. Oh, I woke up straight away. Hello? Bite was upgraded. Right, Archon needs an elixir. There you go, buddy. What was this? Paralyzed guard. Let's put that on you. I think the amount of dust we've had, we would have been able to create one by now, but nope. Mm, nope. I mean, we already created one, I know that much, but... What did you disable? Buy it. Now I need an elixir. Fuck. This cave is, uh... Challenging. I need to drink my elixir. I need my fucking flame bursts. I think we've only got one more max elixir. I think I've got. Don't do that. That hurts. Jesus Christ, that hurt. Alright, eighth floor. Can we get to the middle? This cave is scary! Oh, fuck off, Aaron Matisse. I hate you. You have a passion. I want you to know that. You have a passion. I hate Aaron Matisse. Fuck off. Gives me much pleasure to just body you like that. Oh, why? 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 What was the point in that? What was the point in that? Honestly. Honestly. Now we've got a scum tank. What the fuck? Fuck! Got that crit! Oh, stench. Are you serious right now? I can't do anything. Oh! There's so much damage for you to take. And we miss! <sighs> and you miss Dragon Rage. Land the fucking Dragon Rage. Ninth floor. Where is the middle? Uh, catch a flame burst. You ain't nothing. You ain't nothing. I mean, if you're gonna stay there, I'm just gonna flame burst you again. I need an elixir. A gold bar. Or two or three is a wonderful thing. And that's just what Kofariga Sintan is looking for. You can receive it with trade rare items. That's all well and good, but I need elixirs. Because look, I've got two flame bursts. I'm not wasting my flame bursts on this thing. Sorry, no way. This thing's a different kettle of fish. But I have bite as well, so that's super effective, so. Oh, no, 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 this thing is definitely... I don't want to do it... <sighs> I didn't want to do it with... Fucking wheezing right next to him. We'd have to take on a wheezing as well, and... Oh, no, 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 no. Don't worry, Tropic, you just hang in there. I'm nearly at the stairs. Oh, you bodied him! Good shit! Seems like, to me, we've come pretty far in. Ha! Huh? I see something over there. You're right, let's go check it out. Over there. Oh, is this this? The Pokemon that was flying through the air, sky earlier. It crash landed here. Archon, this is a real Pokemon, isn't it? <laughs> but it's gone all sift as if someone's been stroking it. <laughs> <laughs> Pokemon, you gotta watch out on what you're putting! Ah, oh, no way! It's just like they said! It's been turned to stone! Yes, it definitely looks that way. I don't recognize this Pokemon, though. His name is Latios. He's a legendary Pokemon. What? A legendary Pokemon? That's right. This is the first time I've ever seen him myself, though. Weren't there two Pokemon flying through the sky when we saw them? 
We'll go look around for the other one. Yeah, you do that. What, you're just going to let us go on our own? What are you going to do? Even Latios has been turned to stone. What does all this mean? Laos doesn't live anywhere near here. So what was he doing so far from home? Was he running from something? If he was trying to run away, he didn't make it and was turned to stone. Who, though, could who could have done this? Ah, oh, I'm never going to figure this out alone. If the Denny were here, I could have sent her my questions back to everyone else, but... It never crossed my mind that I'd run into another of these cases. Here, of all places, I know the chief wanted to... Wanting me to try and find out more about these incidents, but... Wait a second. What did I just do? Yeah, I was going to say. I sent them two off alone. Those two kids won't be able to handle whatever did this to Latios. Jigsaw, look at that. Oh, I found it. This one has been turned to stone too. Arshin said the other Pokemon was called Latios, right? This Pokemon looks like a whole lot like it. Maybe they're related to something. Impudent fools. What have you come here for? Who, who's there? Oh! Oh! That's Entei! He came from inside the fire! No way, is this the flaming phantom? I asked you what you have come here for! For what? Wait, for... J just to check! Check what? Whether your t turning Pokemon to stone was a success? Are you the ones who did this? Whoa, you get in What are you getting mad at us for? I am Entei, the Volcanic, and I shall be your end. What? Prepare yourselves for judgment. Jigsaw, looks like we got to a fight. Stop! Archon. Jigsaw and Tropic, stand down. This is not an opponent you can beat. Who are you? My name is Archon, Archon of the Expedition Society. What? Oh, the Expedition Society? Archon the Flightless, yes, I've heard of you. Then those two behind you are also... I will leave this place. If Celebi is not here, then my presence serves no purpose. Wait, Ente! Oh my goodness! You escaped with your lives today. But if you stand in my way, I will not be so merciful. You shall not trouble me again. Be sure of that. Ooh, ain't he serious? Oh my god. He's gone. Are you alright, Archon? Yeah, no worries here. I'm just feeling a little overwhelmed. Facing Ente, I was in a cold sweat of fear, but I couldn't show it. Pathetic, huh? No way, you were so cool. Thank you for saving us. And so we finished our first expedition across the sea. We went back to Barham Town and told everyone what had happened in the forest. And then we got a ride back to Expedition Society HQ from Lapras. By the time we got home it was night and we were all exhausted. We didn't even have enough energy to eat. We went straight to our beds and... Oh wait! No we didn't. Of course we wouldn't skip dinner. Really? Pokemon? Why? Why would you add that in there? Why? 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 We were starving after our adventure we all ate our fill tonight for sure. And then we fell right into our beds. There were a lot of mysteries that we didn't, still didn't understand then. Like why Pokemon were being turned into stone or what Entei had been after. But we had no strength left to wonder. Oh, but there's one last thing I have to say. Archman was really, really cool today. We were able to count on him completely. All the Pokemon in Expedition Society are silly and they're fun to be around. But that doesn't mean they aren't strong. I was really reminded of that today. Being a part of the Expedition Society keeps getting more and more exciting. I can't wait to see what tomorrow will bring. Good night for now. Oh. Oh. And that's how it ended. I'm sorry I couldn't do more. Maybe I could have called out to Ente and told him to stay. But the truth is that I felt relieved when he dashed off. I just couldn't stand up to the pressure he excluded. How many could have? How many could have? Don't feel bad, Archon. This is Entei we're talking about. Anyone would feel petrified in the presence of a Pokemon like that. True! Why, if I ran into him? Oh, just thinking about it. Just thinking about it. 
Today, chief, chef, chief. What's the matter, chief? I'd, I'd. You'd. I'd do anything for a little more to eat. <laughs> okay. Well, there he went. And just as I was hoping to talk about what we should do next, it's not like it's any news, anything new from him. Just let Anfros decide what he wants to do next, and we'll focus on the regular work. I think that's a good enough plan. All right, we can do it. Oh, and I'll continue observing the stars then. Munch, munch, gobble, gobble, slurp. Munch, munch, gobble, gobble, slurp. Munch, munch, gobble, gobble, slurp. <laughs> that hit the spot. When I got scared, I can't help but feeling hungry. Munch, munch, ente, huh? This is becoming a real pain, munch. It's about time for me to stack. <laughs> ah, there's someone there. Ah, my secret food stash from hoarding all the leftovers from everyone's meal, you. Ah, oh, hello, salutations, my, my Swirlix. These perfect apples are really very good. Well, if that's the case... Then Entei, yes, I think I finally have a clue. This is not to be overlooked. Ah, stop your easy man! Yes, if I, if we, if it were in fact Entei and... Stop! For the love of... Yes, if we have to take them on ourselves. <laughs> okay, I think that's as good as not spot as any to wrap up today's episode right here we ended up going to a new continent finding latios and latios in stone facing off a little bit with entei and pooping their pants so if you guys have enjoyed today's episode then please go ahead and like comment and subscribe i've been jamie jigsaw i upload daily and i'll see you guys next time